I know nothing about this place, but literally it was so close to the Annabelle house. Like, this makes me believe this could be like the real Annabelle house. Wait. What? What's no freaking way. That looks like the Annabelle doll. Look at his face. Oh, f Shit. What happened? Let's get out. Let's get out. All right guys, I'm super bored right now. I'm also really cold I'm down here in my basement. There's a place I really want to go check out and that is the Annabelle House in Connecticut. There's some information I found online and I'm gonna read it to you guys. Annabelle the doll is a haunted Raggedy Ann doll stored in a special glass case in the Cult Museum of Psychic Investigations, Ed and Lorraine Warren in Monroe, Connecticut. It originally belonged to a nursing student named Donna, whose mother purchased the doll as a birthday gift. She found it in a hobby store, and at the time, Donna was sharing an apartment with her friend Angie, who was also a fellow nursing student. Soon after the doll entered the apartment, it began to move on its own. What? That is crazy. Yo, if I saw that, like, I probably would have kicked the doll. Sometimes the doll was found with its legs or arms crossed. Several times the doll was left on the couch before the girls left for work. So imagine that you just leave your home and the doll is just in another position on its own. What? Okay, that was says some even more messed up things. When the doll began to leave messages written on parchment paper with please like help me, Donna, Donna, oh, I'm getting goosebumps right now. Donna and Angie sought help from a medium. A science revealed that the doll contained the spirit of a little girl named Annabelle Higgins whose murdered body rests beneath the soil of the apartment complex. Alone and friendless, the spirit of the girl asked if she can remain with Donna and Angie and both agreed to let Annabelle stay with them, but soon even stranger things began to happen. One day, Donna's friend Lo was napping in the apartment when he had a horrible nightmare that Annabelle tried to strangle him to death. Soon after, Lau found claw marks on his chest and so the girls contacted an Episcopalian priest who then recruited renowned paranormal investigators to go check the place out. Ed and Lorraine Warren, they discovered there was never a ghost of a little girl, but rather a demonic presence who wanted to possess the body of the college students. After conducting an exorcism on the apartment, the Warrens removed the doll and placed it among a collection of other haunted objects in a small occult museum within their home, which we're going to be checking out today. While transporting the doll to their house, the Warrens experienced strange forces that caused their car's power stream to fail, their engine to cut off, and their brakes to fail. The disturbances stopped when Ed Warren sprinkled holy water on the doll. Visitors to the Warren Occult Museum are warned not to taunt or challenge the spirit within the doll, because if they do, harm will come to them. Once a motorcyclist visited the museum and told the doll he did not believe it had powers and if it did it should do something to him. On the way home the man crashed into a tree and died. Oh my gosh. I, I can't believe like... Do I really want to check this out? You know what? We're gonna check it out today. And I'm gonna vlog the experience. But I'm gonna call my good friend Ash. She lives around the area. And I think she's also been wanting to check out the place. So yeah, I'll do that right now. Hello. Yo, Ash. Yeah, what's up? So you know how I've always wanted to go check out the animal doll, uh, animal doll, the Annabelle dollhouse nearby like your area? Uh, like the museum? Yeah, yeah, the the cult Warren, the Warren Occult Museum. Yeah, I've been wanting to check it oh, out. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've been there before, so. Right. Well, down. are you are you down to check it out with me? Yeah, for sure. Today. Yeah, yeah, today. Okay. All right, yeah, cool. Yeah. You're you're not scared at all. Uh, Cause I I'm don't a little know. bit scared. I mean, <laughs> I mean, maybe maybe a little, but I heard some really weird stories about that. Yeah, so, what, what do you know about it? Um, well, there's a couple of stories I heard. Um, one of them was that, like, a couple went to the museum, and they were, like, messing with the doll or something, and then something happened afterwards. You actually can check it out. Apparently someone actually, like, 
died in a car crash on the way back. And I heard a couple of stories like that. I, I think I heard about that too. Yeah, that's that's really messed up. We're, we're not gonna be touching the dolls at all, guys. I'm actually vlogging right now. You're you're on you're on the vlog on this call. Oh, uh, hey, hey. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna be vlogging the whole thing, so it's gonna be dope. Okay. You you're cool with that? Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah, cool. Yeah, for sure. All right. Well, I'm gonna start packing up and I'll head to your place or, or your, your area or I'll meet you there actually. All right. Just let me know when you're on your way. I have to do a couple things. All right. All right. Cool. All right. I'll see you later then. All right, yeah. bye. All right, sick. Yeah, there's so many other curse stories that happen to people checking out the museum. I don't know if it's just coincidence or, you know, maybe it depends on the person that went. That Those people that passed away by visiting could have been, like, on something, could have been drunk while driving. I don't know. So... Yeah, we'll, we'll go check it out and I'll, I'll tell you a little bit more history along the way. But I'm gonna start packing now. By the way, if you like what you see, talking about the hoodie, not me. Hoodies for sale, go check it out, freedomx1.com. Alright, so this looks like the Annabelle house. Well, it looks like it's closed off. Probably because of COVID. Damn, that sucks. I'll let Ash know. Hello? Hey, um, so it's up here. Hello? You can you can drive up here to see it. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll come check it out. Yeah, but I got some um some news for you. What? I'll tell you when you get here. Okay. Alright, see you. Here's Ash. Yeah, it's close. Probably because of COVID. Probably. But it looks kind of freaky. I, I didn't think the house would be like, or I didn't think the museum would be a house. It looks, yeah, it literally is just a house. That's so weird. The lights are on inside there. Dude, someone's in there. Yo. I just want to take a, I want to film the house. I want to show people how it looks like. Darn it. Yeah, it's close. And don't you dare trespass to this place. Just come when it's open, guys. I mean, look, please take no it's violators, no trespassing. But I just want to show you guys how the house looks. I'm definitely going to come here once it's open. So the, the doll, the animal doll is here, right? Yeah, that's what I heard. In a little glass case. <sighs> Darn, what should we do now then? You don't know what's around here? Yeah, I have no idea. I've never been out here before. Okay, um... This may sound silly to you, but do you know the app Randonautica? Uh, I think I've heard of it. Maybe that's something we can do. So... It's basically an app that will generate a random coordinate based on your thoughts and intentions. And I've been pretty lucky with it. As crazy as it sounds, like, we really wanted to see the Annabelle doll, like, maybe, I don't know, maybe we can just use it, and maybe it's something to do. It's actually pretty fun. I mean, we can try it. Alright. Well, we'll see what happens. I'm gonna do it right now. Set your intentions. So does it just give you a pin, or...? Yeah, just some random coordinate, like, it could be anywhere. Anything, yeah, could lead us to like McDonald's for all we know. Um, man, I'm so bummed out. Like, I went to check out this place like for for months already, and I I drove five hours here just to see it. I know. That sucks. Does suck. Okay, let's see where this app will take us. Okay, thirteen minutes away. Yeah. Yeah, the radius was set to somewhere nearby here. So not too far. Six miles. We're going. Yeah. A bug just flew in. A bug just flew in? Yeah. Hey, that's good luck. So we're not going to be cursed. I don't know. <laughs> All right, guys. So I just park my car here. And we're going to go through the forest, I guess. It's telling us to go through the trees. 
or up this hill. Ash, what do you think? I think it looks like a whole lot of woods right now. <laughs> I did that last time during my Randautica adventure. We went through the woods, but we didn't find anything. Hopefully, we, hopefully something interesting is here. All right, and it ended. So we gotta go through this. Oh my gosh, it's all overgrown. No, I see a path. I see a good Where path. Right there. So, let's go over here. And I hate these brush. Most people drive must think we're so weird just entering through these woods. Rando nodding. <laughs> Wait, what's that? No way. Oh, f almost tripped. I almost stabbed myself in this rusty thing. Like a trap. Good thing that didn't stab me. That yeah, looks like a house. What? I bet it's abandoned. Yeah, I don't think there's a path. I think there's a trail right here, actually. Looks like some people walk through here. Or maybe animals. Oh, fuck! Ran to a spider web. Oh, hell no. No, 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 we're fine. We are fine. Ah, oh, man, this has thorns. We're good. I got you. <laughs> oh, what? All right, there's a path here. It leads left or right. I think we should go right. right. <sighs> this is so strange. These are definitely animal trails. An animal like just comes through here. Oh, fuck. Get the fuck up. Wow, it is a house in the middle of nowhere, just surrounded and overgrown is by trees. Burned? It has to be. I don't see anyone that oh, could live here. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It looks like someone took it down. Do we just go through here? Yeah, yeah that door's boarded up. I need to get my flashlight. It smells abandoned. Oh, then it's definitely abandoned. I got that bando smell. All right, got my light on. Let's go. Hopefully this can lead upstairs. It's the basement, I assume so. Oh my gosh, it's jam-packed. Please, no animals. Maybe I should throw something inside it. Like what? Like, yeah. Oh, that plastic. Is that even? I need like a good weapon. Like this piece of this spear right here. This probably won't even fight off a wolf, but okay. I'm gonna fight off a spider with that. Yeah, just making sure. Oh, are you okay? Yeah. There's a flashlight right here. You can use this, Ash. Hey, I need that. <laughs> Wait, can it actually work? I don't know. I'll try it. Nope. All right. Oh, I can see the stairs. This is actually really cool and disgusting. Ew, nasty. Okay. Oh yes, yeah, perfect. It does lead up. So I just want to take a look over here. Actually, I'm gonna have to check me for spiders later. What kind of spider is that? What? Oh man. No, see what? Where? It's like, it's black. It's like, not blocking our way, but it's here. Where? Right there. You gotta be careful with these spiders. Is that a black widow? No, there's, bra there's uh, brown widows in Connecticut, I believe, that are poisonous. Deadly <laughs> humans. 
All right, let's be careful. I see those in Vandal actually. Yeah. You tell me what that is. That thing right ahead, right? Yeah. Yeah, that, I mean, I don't know. I can't tell you for certain. Okay, we'll be careful. It could be one of the front ones. Just don't get near it. Oh my gosh. This house has been abandoned for so long. Oh, there's some photos here. That's why there's white. Where? Or whatever it is. Spider? There's a white spider right there. Oh. You see that weird it's thing? It's hard to see, but yeah. It is white. This is creepy. Man, this must have been like a little cozy house back in the day. Looks nice. They left everything behind. This is such a weird fireplace right here. This, this giant thing was a huge fireplace. Yeah, it is stressing me out. There's a lot of spiders. I can walk front. Yeah, all right, either way. I got the stick here. Yeah, those spiders are weird. They're like see-through. That weird spider you were talking about is literally right here on the ground in the entrance. Oh my gosh. Guys, leave a comment down below if you know what type of spider that is. Are like, are we walking through like dangerous poison spiders right now? Is that a brown widow? I don't know. Shit. All right. Well, they're always down, so let's just be on the watch. If you see any spiders on me, you let me know. I will. Not only do you have to look down, but you have to look up too. Yeah. Like on the corners. Yeah. All right, guys, we're gonna. Oh man, I'm sweating so much. I'm sweating so much right now. It's like blazing hot, summer heat. We're gonna be really safe here, though. Check every corners. Make sure we don't walk through these looking brown widow spider-looking things. <laughs> I just recognize your hoodie. I like it a lot. Thanks. Tokyo. <laughs> hmm. This is pretty neat. I feel like old people used to live here. Everything's like sort of vintage. I'm gonna bleep that. What is that? There's sound here. Sounds like power. Mom. It sounds like AC. Yeah, but this place looks so old. Um, Unless we're hearing ghosts. Wait, no. It's ghosts Dang. of the past. Where's that coming from? Someone over there. Here's a map, guys. I'm gonna blur this out. I don't want. You know what? I'm gonna blur like how we got here. This place is actually pretty cool. I don't want this place destroyed or vandalized. But here, here's a map of the area. Oh, that sound is gone. I know, really. What, no, no, I still hear something. If you listen closely. I hear it too. Holy shit. What? Is that like a beehive? Sounds stiff, yeah. Must be old. Someone who brought that in here. Yeah, check your feet. Alright, I'll go ahead. I just want to check the bedrooms now, and then we can get out of here. I'm definitely learning Oh my something. gosh. Are, is, are your legs, like, itching? I have on my legs. My legs are itching right now, too, kind of. I think we might have walked through something. We could have walked through poison ivy or something. Yeah, poison ivy doesn't feel like that, though. I mean, they don't come that quick. They, they like, it takes, like... A day to come or you show. Think so? Yeah, like if you take a shower right when you get home, just make sure you like you scrub really hard and it'll go away. Why I'd have this though. 
If it's not something I'm allergic to, like, it's so weird. I don't know. What's this? It's like a leather from 1906. Yeah, that's really old. That noise is coming through here. It only sounds like there's still power in here. There can't be. Look at it. Well, we're about to find out. Yeah. Okay, watch yourself here. Well, we're getting closer to that power thing. It's a refrigerator. What? It's still running? Yeah. That doesn't make any sense. There's no power here. Is there someone that lives here? Actually, no. No one would live. You don't know that. Dude, uh, no, but the power is still here. I'm kind of freaked out now, honestly. I... We are so confused right now. Like, how is this thing turned on? This refrigerator looks pretty old, too. It's on. It is seriously on, guys. Should we open it? Oh my god, there's so many of those brown spider looking things here, though. Yeah. Uh, let's just go upstairs. Yeah, what? Careful right there. I see them. Oh, and brown. That's huge. That one's huge right there. Where? Right here. I can't get us though. Do you want to open this? Um, I'm just really, really confused. It's not opening from this side. Could someone be in here? Doubt it. Well, that w how could that be on? Why would anyone live here? Oh, let's check upstairs. I don't Where's even. Where's your steps, Steve? Like right here. Let's step right here. I'll be fine. Yep. All right, I'm gonna walk up. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Make sure there's nothing. Mm, looks fucking scary right there. It looks like a freaking nest. That is creepy as heck. Oh my gosh. What? There's dolls in here. Oh shit. But I didn't see anyone. So I think we're good. So I didn't check this room though. Anyone here? Oh my gosh, there's so many knives. I just want to get out now. Dang. There's so much stuff. Look at the letters. These must have been from the original owners that used to live here. It's probably like a bunch of places they've been to. Look at that. They traveled to like Japan. And the Stonehenge. Pause the screen if you want to read these letters. It's just too much to read right now, and I just want to get out of here. But I'm going to show you them really quick. Just pause the screen. Yeah, I'm, I'm not walking through here. I don't know how many spiders are just laying around trying to get on the legs. So, yeah, but this is pretty cool. This is one of the biggest bedrooms. Probably the... the, the this probably was the queen room. Let's check the other room though. That one looked even way more weird and freaky. Did you go through here already? No, no, yeah, let's go. Let me see the stick. Dad, there's so many notes. I know nothing about this place, but literally it was so close 
to the Annabelle house. Like, this makes me believe this could be like the real Annabelle house. Wait. What? What's that? No freaking way. That looks like the Annabelle doll. Look at its face. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Like, what the fuck? No, this is like no joke right now. First, we wanted to go see the, uh, the Animal Museum today. It was closed down. I used the Randonica app. Like today was, I've been waiting to like go to that museum forever. It was closed down because of coronavirus and now that app led us here. That doll looks like the Animal doll. That shit really must be possessed. This is, this is too much right now. I've been getting really lucky with this Randonautica app. How does it even get here? It, they must have had it. Look how old it is, it's rotting away. Guys, here's a picture of the Annabelle doll right here. This is how it looks like. Look at it. They look identical. I'm not touching that. We gotta get out of here. Like, the Annabelle doll's no joke. But let's- oh, I just wanna see more letters. So just pause the screen, guys, if you wanna read this. Leave a comment down below and try to maybe leave it for us to read. I'm sure people will appreciate that. This, this is too freaky and bizarre. Wow, I like how this is set up, though. And look, these pictures are old. They could have been the people that used to live here. This place had to be built around the 1800s. And they probably lived here until like the early 1900s. This looks like a female Babadook. Have you seen that horror film? No. <laughs> Babadook? Yeah. It's just like that. Babadook. Babadook. Oh my god, there's another creepy doll right here. There's too many creepy things going on. There's a small little knife right here. That doll looks possessed too, like... Imagine that doll just jumped up with that knife. What, what, what would you do? Die, probably. Would you just run and leave me here? Yep. I just <laughs> out the window. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Ash. You're welcome. That is... That is so freaky. I'm not... You know, touch these dolls. It could be bad juju or whatever, voodoo. Their eyes. I know. Let's get a close up. That thing moves its arm and grab that. You know what I would do? What would you do? I would probably throw it out the window, honestly. <laughs> Actually, no, because we had to escape. I don't know what I'd do. Honestly. I'm not sure. Nah, nah, we're, we're gonna survive. Mm -hmm. Survive that stuff. Oh, I'm sweating so much. My adrenaline is going off the charts right now. Like, I'm pretty freaked out, but yet at the same time, I want to show you guys how this whole weird haunted house looks like. Like, this is such a crazy find. You can tell no one's been here. There's no graffiti. I don't know. We're next to the Annabelle house. Now, I, I really think like this could be the real Annabelle doll. Why would it just be here? Look, there's some newspapers from 1950. There's a date right there. Got some old radio set. Another photo. Did I see what? The goggles. No, I didn't see the goggles. That is pretty dope. There's a lot of cool vintage stuff in here. Yeah. Like, look at that little guitar. Where's that violin? That's a... No, yeah. <laughs> it's not a guitar. Uh, it's... You would know this, right? I don't want to embarrass myself. <laughs> it's a You're... violin. It's just a violin. You came from a family that does music. Ash. <laughs> what type of guitar? It's a violin. Yeah, I think it's a violin. What's this, like... What's this, like a baby stroller? Carriage? A baby You probably did have a baby. And there's like a uh, chest, which I'm gonna open right now. Oh, oh my god! No, I'm just <laughs> 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 okay. All right, that's that's. All right, there's nothing to joke here. Like I'm really creeped out. I'm keeping my eyes on the dolls, honestly. Like I'm kicking those dolls if they move. 
what's in this room. I almost forgot about the spiders. We gotta make sure there's no spiders. Wow. The all the spiders yeah, yeah, I think they did. There's no there's no spiders here at all. Yes, they definitely scared them off. What am I missing? Am I missing? Did we see through everything? What's that say? Fear not, for I am with thee. I don't think we have nothing to fear, so we're good. Who's with thee? Yeah, who's with us? You know what? I'm gonna take out this spirit box right now. I think this place could be potentially haunted. And then we can get out. Yeah, I can't wait to get out of here. I'm so freaked out. Alright, last video. If you guys didn't check it out, I also did a haunted house. And at first, I didn't know how to use it, but I know how to use the spirit box now. Ash, can you, like, just film me? Just point the camera. It's already recording. This too. You know what? I'm gonna leave this in front of the Annabelle doll. Oh, gosh, I'm sweating. I'm AM, FM. Oh, the temperatures. The temperatures going off the chart. All right. If there's any spirits in here, would you make a noise? Would you say something? You can use the spirit box to say something. It could be anything. Just let us know your presence. Who used to live here? I'm pretty sure I'm using this right. Is there anyone here with us right now? That's... What was that? Can you say a word? What did that sound like? Huh? What did that sound like? It sounds like, so like, weird. Ah, like something like some weird scream. Hang on. Change the speed rate. Can you communicate with us again? Can you say something? If you don't say something, I'm taking this doll. What's that beeping noise? It's literally not so- oh, it's the temperature. The temperature just went up for some reason. Come on. Make your presence known. Say something. I feel like I feel like I'm gonna provoke the spirit here if we want something. That was weird. That that noise was like some demonic scream. Is there anyone that passed away here? All my settings right now. I got the sweep set. I got FM AM. Oh wait. There we go. Hello. Is there anyone here? Nothing. I'm getting something right now. Were these your dolls? If a spirit is in here, did this belong to you? I need a good question. Oh, let's ask if this is the animal doll. If there's anything in here, any entity. Oh, what did I say? It just said something. We're picking up stuff now. Yeah, it did sound like a female. All right, please stay in this room. If there's an entity here, let us know. What doll is this? Is this the animal doll? What did that say? It said like fight. Fight me? Or find me? Maybe find me? What do you mean by fine? Are you somewhere around this house? We don't have time to find you. You have to... You have to let us know. Like... Do you want us to find 
you? Is that why you brought us here? Yeah, did you want us to find you? I mean, we kind of did find it with the Rando Randonica app. Something Did you hear that? Oh my god, the temperature is rising. Who used to live here? Can you say your name for us? Ma I think I heard Maggie. Start? Start what? What did he want us to do? Get out? You want us to leave? It sounded like a male voice telling us to get out, though. Oh my god, it's just spiking up again. It did get a little bit hot around here. But I don't know if that's my body heat. He wants to get out. I think it did say yeah. I thought you wanted us here. Well, alright. I guess we should head out. But first, I'm gonna take your Annabelle doll. No! Touching it. Don't touch take the it. doll, Steve. I'm gonna take it with us. Oh, what happened? Let's get out. 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 Okay, we're getting out. All right, there's something wrong. It's just going to be. All right. Um, dodge the spiders, okay? Careful here, okay? Why? What's over there? The spider. Or just tell me where to step. Just keep going straight. Step right here. Like she... Right there? Yeah. Okay. Now, just be careful. Alright, now come here. Just follow me, okay? Step right here. Careful of that spider. Right there. Yeah, right here. Yeah, we're really trying to get the hell out of here, but the spire's just making us walk a little bit more calmly. All right, careful here. Just gonna walk straight. Careful of the corners. Yeah, there's literally one on both sides and the in the top corner. So just go straight in the middle. Like right there. Like I'm like. Oh, All right, we're almost out of here. Oh, oh fuck! All right. Oh my god, the spider's moving right there. Do we just go through here? Wait, yeah, we do. We get out from there. Right there. Careful over here, okay? Wait, where there's a spider in the entrance? Oh my god, the one on the top is moving too. Where? Where? Oh my gosh. All right. Well, this is the last part. We have to. Yeah, there's one right there around the corner. This is the worst part. Yeah, but once that we thing get out of this. I'm making a web right now. No, 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 no. Don't get it to come down here. No, 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 it's not. I'm just making sure there's no web in front of us. All right, ready? Nope. You got this. Everyone root for Ash. You got this. We gotta get the hell out of there. There's possessed demon dolls, but these spars are way worse. I'm more scared of this one. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go. Wait, try to over here. Oh, shit. The bag is hitting everything. All right, come. Wait, I just need a second. Where do I go? Just go straight. I can't really see myself. Okay, ready? Oh. All right, calm down. All right, we're almost out. I don't know, but let's check our bags when we get outside. Really. Civilization. All right, everyone, we made it back to our car, safe and sound. What a Renautica adventure. It's kind of making me want to start not doing it, but man, the stuff that you can find is just so crazy. <sighs> anyway, 
I don't know what to think about this. I don't know what to think about the place. That animal doll or that doll looked so similar to animal doll. And everything just seemed to like synchronize. Synchronicity. Yeah, that, I don't know. The app says like whatever your thoughts or intentions are that will attract you to whatever it is. And it seemed to happen again. Anyway, definitely check out Ashes too. She got an Instagram. It's Romano.ash. Yeah, we, we take some bomb ass photos of places that we explore, like a band places. So go check it out. Link it down in the description. Uh, I'm exhausted. And yeah, I don't think Ash is going to join me on a rando adventure again. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, but yeah, if this video gets maybe 5,000 thumbs up, I'll do another one. You guys have been loving it. So yeah, let's get the thumbs up on this video. Like and share and subscribe if you enjoy the content. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.